This is the good side where the rust on the wheel arch end of the rear quarter goes just a little bit higher than the patches they make. So I've made my own patch. It's got a long way to go. I'm probably going to chop a lot of it off and throw it away. And I'm probably not going to use all of it depending on how much rust is down here and I'll find out when I start cutting it open. So what we have here is the bad side. Here's a repair patch aftermarket I got from OPGI. And I'll have to fab up a piece to do whatever I need to do here. Looks like this inside piece is okay. I can still see a galvanized finish on it and I've already started cleaning off the old quarter panel here. I've also got to make a couple of pieces for the wheel arch in here as well. I was comparing my left hand side reproduction patch to this good old factory steel here. And I noticed the quarter panel comes down turns in horizontal and there's a lip where it joins to the inside panel and at its broadest just under two inches. Now I take my patch where it turns in at its broadest it's not even one inch. So they don't sell you this steel when you buy a reproduction patch. Mine seems more rusty on this outer edge, but I'm sure everybody wants to join this patch where the factory joined the quarter down here. I'm pretty disappointed I don't have this steel on my patch. I will plug weld my patch onto this inside panel as the factory have joined this here, which means I have to put an extension on this thing that costs nearly a hundred dollars and costs a lot of money to ship across to Australia going to be almost as much work fitting this as making this. These creases, which is really what you're buying here, are lined up with where the factory steel is. And I've cut just enough steel away around it so that the bottom part of this patch can clamp in where it needs to be overlapping the rest of the quarter. I had to peel out this edge here because it was a square turn in on the patch and it's rounder on the factory steel. Okay, I've mocked this up, it's clamped in. That's my just under two inches gap there. Now all I have to do is something about this huge hole. <laughs> that's the shits. Look, that's correct, and I can put, that's in the right spot, and I can put my whole hand in there. <laughs> 